gentlemen. Assassin. The Cater. Hey guys, welcome to the first of the promised frequently asked question videos. I'm gonna start with add-ons. Uh, so I've messed around with a fair few add-ons, but these are the only add-ons I really use continuously. You've got Bartender 4, that's your basic bar add-on, uh, moving your action bars around. It's pretty handy if you're not enjoying, you know, the standard UI. Uh, it gives you a few more bars to play around with as well. Uh, bonus scanner that that just comes with one of the uh, uh, one of the other add-ons. It doesn't really do much. Uh, Omni CC uh, shows timers on all the abilities you've got on your enemy, uh, all your cooldowns, and yeah, everything else. It, it's basically all about cooldowns. Uh, Omni CC pulse basically just makes a flash whenever uh, you know makes the ability flash out whenever you. Uh, whenever it's back off cooldown. Uh, recount, just your basic damage meter add-on. Scrolling combat text, I get a lot of questions about what my combat text is. Scrolling combat text is what I use. It takes a bit of config, but it's, you know, relatively easy to set up and it looks good, it looks sweet. SCT options is obviously related to that as well. Uh, I get asked a lot which macros I use. I only use a few, I prefer to keep things pretty simple, be able to utilize my buttons for pretty much every situation. Um, I use a stealth macro, it's just a spammable stealth macro, it means when you hit it constantly, you know, uh, you don't get pulled straight out of stealth for hitting it again, as you would if you had just your normal stealth button there. Uh, the other macro I use, uh, Deadly Throw. It's basically deadly throw and throw macro into the one thing. It'll throw, uh, you know, your deadly throw if you have combo points. If not, it'll just cast throw. Uh, I've got a focus kick macro. That, that one's pretty self-explanatory. Uh, sap macro. This basically targets whatever is, you know, in range, closest to you. And uh, it'll sap that good for, you know, unstealth and rogues. Uh, with sap getting the opening, you know. Uh, also, just the tricks of the trade macro is it's pretty basic. Basically, just targets uh, targets player cast tricks of the trade and targets your last target. Uh, someone else asked what the best setup for two v two as a rogue is. That depends on your spec and playstyle, but right now I'm running rogue mage, the classic rogue mage. Another good comp would be uh, rogue priest, discord shadow. Uh, or, you know, Rogue Feral Druid, Rogue Resto Druid. There's a lot of comps. You can go with a lot of, uh, a lot of classes as a Rogue. Uh, classes to avoid, though, would be Hunters, Warriors, uh, Holy Paladins as well. Just, uh, don't have much synergy with those classes. One of the reasons uh, I haven't been doing 2v2 uh, with Swifty, as some people have requested, uh, I do. Yes, I, I do read the comments. <laughs> Hopefully this answered some questions for some of you. Remember, if your question wasn't answered here, it may have been answered in the road guide that I have up on Swifty's site. And if it's not in there, well, you can ask it here and I'll try and get to it next time. That is in the comments below this video. Cheers guys, no cap.